Once upon a time, Abraham Lincoln abolished slavery in the US, and it was abolished in 1833 in the UK. Well, so we're told. However, if we take a look at the physical world, we can see a different story. Slavery still existed until very recently. Apart from 1% of the population, we were all slaves to society. Those with the wealth of billions dictated to and controlled those with millions, and those with millions allowed it. Those with millions dictated to and controlled those who didn't struggle financially. They may not have had millions, but they were what we call comfortable. They knew what it felt like to have a master and be obedient to that master. And not only did they allow it, they actually passed it on. The slavery got passed down the line through control from bosses, from councils, from companies, from corporations, from landlords, from governments and governing bodies, law enforcers, financial establishments and educators. It was passed down the line until it reached us. All those people told us what we should think, what we should feel and what we should do. We were slaves. We were controlled, controlled by fear. It was all done through fear. You must do that, you must do this, or you'll lose your job and you won't have any money. You must behave like this, you must behave like that, because society says so. And if you actually think for yourself, you'll get punished, cancelled and denied. You had to be a machine. You had to obey. You had to be a slave. Well, only if you allowed it. That was then, and this is now. We can only be controlled by other people if we let them control us. It appears that it was always the little guy that got punished. The hard worker was always the person taking one for the team. It used to be like that until recently, until now. The times changed and are changing still. Eyes are opening and eyes were opened, including third eyes and consciousnesses were jolted into action. People considered the ways in which the world worked or rather didn't work. People saw beyond the narrative, beyond the lies, beyond the stupidity and through the blanket of fake. People were, and always will be, free, sovereign beings. They're never to be traded. They're not commodities on the world's stock markets. They're never to be sold, trafficked, used and abused. Slavery finally did end and everyone came together to work and collaborate in harmony. Humanity came out of the dark and into the light, the light of love. Love always wins, and love conquers all.